Loot anime. It's what happens when you run out of a shop with a Naruto DVD without paying. Now, that was a pretty nifty intro there. Um, as you can see, today uh, we have in front of us a loot anime box uh, thing. I'll be honest with you, I've, you know, been mildly tempted to get a loot crate for a couple of years, but everything's a bit too, like, wide ranging, kind of like everything's vaguely pop culture to the point where nothing's kind of all that special. Um, you know, I like Ghostbusters, but I don't particularly want any memorabilia from it and stuff. Anime, however, I do tend to generally like most of the mainstream stuff. Uh, which means that this box may be more up my alley. So this is my first sort of attempt at it. I've signed up for a three-month thing. So I'll stop rambling now. I'll just crack this one open uh, and we'll see what goodies are inside. And as with sort of snack boxes that I do and stuff as well, uh, you know, if I like it, I will continue. Right, I'm going to cut this open. This is actually quite a lot thicker than I thought it would be. All right, no it wasn't. I was just an idiot and cutting it at the wrong angle. Now, as with my snack box videos, I'm kind of grab inside these because, like, I don't want to show everyone what's in here because it'll kind of spoil it, won't it? So, um, I'm just going to grab things. Um, I think there's a leaflet at the end that tells us exactly what they are. Now, okay, already we've got what even is... Now, I know there's an Evangelion-themed thing. Uh, ooh! Okay, this is actually... Oh, wow! Right, uh, I'm gonna have to hold it back a little bit there. This is a My Hero Academia, like, water flask thing. That's actually kind of cool. So that's the straw thing there. Um, and yeah, this is for, like, you know, you can take it jogging with you or whatever, and it sort of attaches. Uh, let's take a look at the printing. So we've got a, uh, we got them all in their kind of school uniform and stuff. So can't remember his name. That's uh, to to you, yeah, or um, Froppy, Todoroki, Uravity, um, Ur Uraraka. There's uh, Ida, Bakugo, and Deku. That's actually really nice as well. And it's a little bit red coloured, and it's BPA approved means, you know, the water's not going to poison you if you drink or something. Okay. That's actually pretty cool. I mean, admittedly, if I went jogging, I wouldn't take this. Um, just because, like, it's quite <laughs> it's quite bright. But it's something to have around my room, actually. Just sort of, like, sort of filling a small cup or something. That's actually really cool. Okay, right. Uh, quite impressed with that. Put that there. I do like that these things tend to come with things that you can actually like use and stuff, not just necessarily, uh, hang on, right, there's a t-shirt, ooh, black, hang on, I, well, I read the word, ooh, it's Black Lagoon, hang on, I'll be right back. Alright, so I've had to um, hold my camera stand basically, because obviously it's a big t-shirt, but as you can see, it is a Black Lagoon themed uh, t-shirt. It's got that lady from it. I'll be honest, I've not seen Black Lagoon. Uh, it is on my list of stuff to watch, as is about 200 dozen other animes. But I'll be honest, that is pretty cool because, you know, it's, it's fairly, I mean, well, it's not subtle, I suppose, but it's not in your face. It's kind of, you know, a little bit... People know what Black Lagoon is, that's awesome. Um, you know, and if they don't, they'll be like, oh, okay, cool. Now, this is an XL, I believe, because I tend to like them quite baggy on me. Anyway, I'll um, return to a normal camera angle now. All right, okay, next up is... Ooh, and there's some stuff in the background. Get a pin, I think, every month. Uh, ooh, is this No Game No Life, I believe? Uh, let me have a double check on that. And yes, it is indeed No Game No Life. Uh, this seems to be like a pin of the first volume of the manga or something. Uh, that's actually pretty cool. And of course there's some like... I don't know, there's some code or something you can use on the website. Uh, it's actually quite nice, I'll, I'll be honest. I'm not really sure where I'd put that. You know, because it's quite a big pin and stuff, but whatever. Uh, right, ooh, uh, I feel a manga. I know there's always a volume of a manga. And this is upside down. Uh, oh, Bungo Stray Dogs. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Um, that's another sort of series I've 
been kind of interested in, but um, <laughs> as I think any anime fan will attest, really, it's kind of one of those things like, oh man, I've heard of that series, I'll definitely get around to reading it in 2025. Um, and yeah, this is the back. I presume, like, this is a either the first volume or, like, maybe a loot anime special cover or whatever, but, you know, obviously it is the first volume of the manga, which is always nice, I think. Admittedly, it does mean if you subscribe to this for you know, a year you end up with 12 volume ones of different manga series. But, you know, if you don't like them, I'm sure you can give them to friends or charity shops or something. But yeah, it's like about mafia or something, like some kind of supernatural-y kind of thing. Bit durarara e maybe? Or maybe I've completely misunderstood where it is. Now, this is feeling pretty empty, so I think we're near the end here, actually. Uh, we have... What is this? Okay, so not quite as uh, exciting. There's apparently a t an Attack on Titan t-shirt, but it's not in this box because there's a delay for it or something. So they're sending it on with the September crate, uh, which is cool, you know, and a nice bit of white cardboard to start your character designs. And I think that might be it. So let's have a look. Uh, is this Attack on Titan themed, I suppose? Because that kind of looks like the Titan, doesn't it? And is that Eren? I can't really make out. Oh, um, I'll be honest, I've only watched the first series of Attack on Titan. Uh, right, let's see what is outlined here. Um, and also I believe... Ah, wow, okay, so there's an Attack on Titan poster, uh, which is hard to show, I'll be honest. Right, this does seem like it was particularly themed after Attack on Titan or something. So, this is squad theme, uh, which is nice. Now, I believe this is July's one that is, like, late or something. So, we have an exclusive Black Lagoon t-shirt. Very nice. Uh, we have a Attack on Titan t-shirt, uh, which has not arrived. Um, let's see. We have the no, no Game No Life Volume 1 pin. Uh, we have the My Hero Academia water bottle, and of course the first volume of Bungo Stray Dogs. So yeah, um, I'll be honest, it's it was a pretty good, pretty good thing. Um, you know, I can't rem really remember the price point to be honest, so I can't really tell you guys how much value I got from this because I think I signed up for like three months, as I said. So I think it was total. You know, overall, this is very nice. I'm, I'm happy to have anime-themed merch to drink from, uh, as is everyone, obviously, I'm sure. Uh, you know, manga is always nice, uh, and the t-shirt is really cool. Shame about the other t-shirt didn't arrive wherever. This pin, I have no idea what I'm going to do with it. But, you know, you can use it on the website, I think, if you get the crate. So, yeah, that about wraps up this month's explosion loot anime so yeah i think actually that's the t-shirt design as well isn't it um just a lot obviously cooler in um you know t-shirt form with the vibrant colors so um yeah stay tuned so i may actually be doing one of these in the next two or three weeks because july's loot anime was delayed which i think is this one so next month's one I think has an Evangelion themed item, which I'm quite excited for, because I fucking love Evangelion. Um, so yeah, see you. Goodbye.